Hello everyone and welcome to ACAD Guild. This is the third video in the sort and filter section where we'll see how to do multi-level sorting in single column in Excel. Okay, what I'm trying to say is I have multiple criteria in the single column. That means if you see there are some records which are highlighted in green, yellow, red, orange and so on. So there are so many records if I scroll down there are a few records at the bottom also which I've just highlighted in different colors. You see, I'm just scrolling down. Okay. Now what I want to do is have a look here. My condition is for sorting. First, they should be sorted in the based on the color background color. So if you see there are some yellow color, I want this yellow color on the top. Okay. That's my first sorting criteria. Second is based on that coloring, whatever you have sorted, I want based on values also to be sorted. Okay, let me first show you practically rather than theoretical. So the question is how to do multi level sorting in single column, right? Now, keep your cursor in any column which you want to sort like in the date of hire, we have a shortcut key named as alt a s s alt a s s, you'll get this dialog box, right? The other method is go to data tab, click on this sort button, you'll get this dialog box. But my favorite shortcut key is keep your cursor in the column alt a s s. Now, date of hire. So from this drop down, you can select date of hire. Now, first condition is I don't want to sort based on the values, but I want to sort based on the cell color. Okay, you have other options as font color and cell icon cell color. And what color do you want on top? There are two options on top and on bottom on top. So I want one color on the top. This is the color, which is this orange color. Select this orange color and then click on OK. Now, if you observe this orange color is on the top. What about the other colors? What about the yellow color? Yellow color and this green color is at the bottom or some other position because I have not given any criteria for that. I just gave a criteria for this particular orange color. So how do I find out the dialog box alt a s s. This is on the top. Now, in that date column, carefully observe. Okay, in this column, if you observe, what are the order of this pay? Is it ascending or descending? It is neither ascending nor descending. So what I want is once this is sorted based on the color, I want this to be sorted based on the descending color descending order. Okay, the pay column should be in the descending order. So let us go ahead. Alt A S S. Now, I'll just click on this add level. Okay, add level. And then you can select the option from here in the drop down as pay and select the options. But this was not my criteria. My criteria was how to do multi level sorting in single column. Okay, in single column. So here if you observe, the date I have sorted based on the color. This is sorted in the descending order. Carefully observe this is in the descending order. Now what I want is I want to sort this column again on the descending order. So again, Alt A S S click on add level. You see, I'm taking same column date of hire. I'll not take another column date of hire. Now this time I'll take the values. I'll not take the cell color or font color. Select the option as values. How do you want to sort based on ascending or descending? So right now we have oldest to newest that would be in the uh, that would be in the ascending order. But now if I say newest to oldest, okay, newest to oldest, this would be in the descending order. So I'll, I'll just click on this OK button and carefully observe, carefully observe. This is first of all sorted based on color date of hire and second is the bigger dates are on the top and the smaller dates are on the bottom part, right? So this is how you can do multiple uh, multi level sorting on the single column. Now, why do I call it as multi level? So if I press alt a s s, you see, these are two levels, this one level and second level, you see, there are two levels. How do I find out these are levels? If you click on add level, add level, these are the levels which gets added. You can select and delete level, delete level. So these two levels are based on the single column. How do I find out? You see, that's a date of hire. Okay. These are based on single column here. Okay. And you can simply click on. Okay. 
So this is how you can work on this advanced sorting part itself, right? I hope you have understood how to do multi-level sorting in single column in Excel. And that's all for this video.